and welcome to the OWC instructional series of videos. In this installment, we're going to show you how to install an internal drive in a pre-2008 Mac Pro. These instructions can also be used to replace the boot drive, but if you're going to do that, you'll want to follow the backup and restoration instructions linked to at the beginning and ending of this video. We've already shut down, unplugged, and placed the Mac Pro on a soft, static-free surface. We are now ready to begin. The first step is to open the side access door. To do this, lift the latch located in the rear of the Mac Pro until it locks into the open position. You may then tilt the door forward slightly, lift it out of its channel, and set it aside. The four hard drive bays are located in the center of the Mac Pro, here. To remove a hard drive tray, be sure that the rear latch is still in the unlocked position, then pull the tray straight out of its bay. There are four screws on the drive tray, which correspond to the four holes on the bottom of the drive we're going to install. Make sure the SATA connection is towards the back end of the tray. Now line up the screws with the holes in the hard drive and tighten them down with your Phillips screwdriver. Finally, align the tray with the tracks in the bay and slide it back into the Mac Pro, making sure it gets seated flush into place. To close the Mac Pro, align the side door with the bottom of the case, raise the door so it sits flush, then push the rear latch downward until it locks. You can now hook your Mac Pro back up, plug it in, and turn it on.